Hello YouTube, welcome back to the Web Gear Review. If you like web gear and things about the military, stuff like that, you come to the right place. At the Web Gear Review, we're going to show you some more web gear today. Alrighty, what we're looking at right here is, of course it is a, um, a fourth pattern, M1941 uh, knapsack, or... A lot of people like to refer to it as an M44 modified, but we'll go into that later. What I want to show you today is, is I want to show you two different configurations uh, from the United States Marine Corps pack configurations. I believe there were about nine of them. Uh, you can look back at some of my other videos. I've, I've uh, did a few videos on some of the others. But what I'm going to show you today is two configurations in one video. And the reason is they're so simple. What you're looking at right here is the simple, simplest of all the pack configurations that there is. And this is called the knapsack pack hand carry. Now, all you would do is you just take this strap right here, okay, that used to retain it to the bottom of the Haver sack, you tighten it up as tight as you can get it, and you just simply hand carry it like that. I mean, it don't get no simpler than that. Now, you might say, well, uh, huh, but if you really think about it, you can use this to carry your stuff on a, a small trip. Uh, when I go uh, traveling, I usually use a little backpack or something anyway, because, I mean, if you ain't taking a lot with you i mean that'll carry a change of clothes and you know some deodorant and things but anyway the pack configuration here this was used you can see pictures of the marines actually walking and carrying these on okinawa and other uh, other places but so it is a real handy configuration now the second configuration that i want to share with you today it takes two components it takes a haversack. Now this can be the first, second, third, or fourth pattern haversack. Uh, so it doesn't have to be just any of them. But however, what you do, this is called the knapsack musette pack. Okay. Undo this strap right here. Take your trouser belt off. Okay. Got to have a trouser belt. Okay. You take it. You simply attach your trouser belt to the retaining strap. See that? Then you take the trouser belt and you put this in in here. Okay? And then, of course, you make the adjustment what you need. Now you have a musette bag that you can just throw across your shoulder. Now, this would be handy just going in the bush, uh, going in the woods or anything. If you needed a little extra bag to carry a little extra uh, uh, goodies or something with you, uh, that would even make a good school bag to carry your stuff to school in. I mean, my day, we didn't use bags or packs to carry our stuff to school, but, uh, you know, everybody does nowadays, so... It might be a good idea to get a young kid into collecting. Give him one of these here. Uh, give him a, a trouser belt. Make him a, a little a musette bag. But anyway, these were used uh, in lieu of the officer bag. If a officer didn't have one or was in need one or needed an extra. Uh, but any Marine could put this uh, configuration together and just throw it over his shoulder and uh, he'd be on his way, okay? But that's the two configurations we looked at today. This here is called...